cost of living is so high in Oakland that it's very easy to slip into homelessness. I understood that many people who are homeless or simply panhandling, desperately poor, they're um, invisible. And that when you walk down the street, most people just look through them, they step around them, they don't acknowledge them. Homeless comes in different colors, it comes in different sexes. Um, people who are homeless because of health problems, they're homeless because of mental health problems, because of addiction, because of really bad luck. Um, there are a lot of different reasons why people are homeless. But what they don't know, we went through something that most people haven't went through. You know, until you experience being homeless, actually on these streets when it's raining and it's cold, you can't judge judges by, you know, by the way we act sometimes or the way we dress. Um, fortunately, we're not able to have all the things that we used to have to look, you know, representative. St. Vincent de Paul um, provides direct services to the community. So everything from basic needs, uh, food and drink, we provide that. What they do here at St. Vincent de Paul is it's a beautiful thing. Um, to have a place like this to come to six days, but well, five days out of a week, it's, it's beautiful. Homelessness is something that a lot of our clients are moving through. They're homeless right now, they weren't homeless before, and hopefully in the future they won't be homeless again. Um, being here with the people here, I mean, they really have my back. They support me here, like most people. We're still humans, you know, we're still somebody. Being around our clients has really opened my eyes to see what truly being homeless looks like and what they have to go through. Um, it's exciting to be a part of an organization that's really trying to make a difference in the community. One day I will be out the homelessness thing. Um, it's a slow process, so it's, it's beautiful to, to get up to come somewhere and you can take a cat nap or wash your clothes, and get yourself dressed and get on the computers, um, meet, see some of your friends, meet other people, um, very intelligent people here too, um, to be able to join into um, culinary trip, uh, kitchen champions. Um, this place, St. Vincent's helped out with a whole, whole lot. There might be people out there who choose to be hung homeless. It's not their fault. There's a, the director for this amazing group um, called Everyone Home, she said something in a meeting to me once that I thought was just amazing. She said that hunger and homelessness are the res direct results of public policy. That the reason why we have people in the streets that are hungry, the reason why we have people without homes, is because we have not said that that is wrong. You actually sit down and talk to the people that's out there on the streets that are homeless. Um, really sit down and listen to what they've been through. Um, without judging them by the way they look and the way they smell. Um, take the time out to help them out. Um, if it ain't nothing, just to buy them something to eat or to help them get a job somewhere or to offer them some type of work. Um, there's a lot of us out here, children and all. Um, so please, whatever you guys do out there, don't judge us. Get a chance to know us before judging.